IGN Redemption Arc. Okay. Nah, you know what it is, bro? I think Fidel hacked them, bro. Fidel did something. Fidel did something, bro. What if Fidel low-key is a phantom thief and he changed their heart? That's why he's sponsored by Atlas. It all makes sense. He's a fucking phantom thief. He went into IGN's palace, changed their hearts. That's why they keep giving him free persona shit. Because low-key, he was a phantom thief. Doesn't Isn't it weird that now IGN has just a random change of heart with Sonic the Hedgehog? Tell me not. That's why Fidel followed me. Because he knew that I was the number one persona. Yo! It all makes sense. He was a phantom thief the whole time. I know his secret. Bro. The problem was at the Game Awards, he wasn't fast enough. He didn't have enough time to change the Game Awards shit because he ran out of days. He should have had more party members. He didn't have enough. You're his Mishima? No! I don't want to be no fucking Mishima. Put me as Ryuji or something. Not Mishima. Fuck! Fidel Finasteel Retro's balls next. <laughs> my balls? I'm his Morgana? Oh my god, I'm a cat. When a kid has something in his hand and he don't want it no more, the way they just throw it, they just be... They be like, get that shit off me. I don't want it no more. My dandelion is all gone. No! Game's Cage, you motherfucker! He's following me! Fuck! Why did you guys gift him a sub? Now he's in here! Fuck! Oh my god, dude! No! Bro! Why the hell y'all guys gifted a sub to Game's Cage? Now Game's Cage is gonna be in here! Bro! You said ain't no escaping me! Why are you bring the Sonic Man himself? <laughs> hold on, 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 hold on. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to VIP this motherfucker though. I have to VIP. This guy get instant VIP privileges. Hold on. I'm gonna have to put this man in the VIP. Yo, Games Cage, what's popping, brother? What's popping, man? Bro, one of you guys gifted him a sub. You bums. I noticed it, and I was like, bro, he's gonna see that shit. He is going to see that shit, and he's gonna come straight in here. You said I'm Bing Chilling? Like my man John Cena. I forgot how it goes. I said Zhou Chen Zhuo. Bing Chilling. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm about to ask you a very important question. Fidel, please. I have to know your opinion on Sonic Colors, please. I, I, I have to know your opinion, please. Please. What, what is your opinion on Sonic Colors? Sonic Mommy Milker. Top three! You're smoking! No, 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 no. Stop the music. Top three! This man said top three on Sonic Colors. Please. Please. I cannot. I cannot. He said top three. Yo, I hate that game so much. Top three. You said not the remake? Is there a difference between the remake and the original? It's top three. It's the only... Okay, it's one of the only games that is consistent. The OG is better than the remake. But isn't the remake the exact same game? Or how are they both different? The original is far better. How? If they're, aren't they the same game? Yes, it is. It's the same. People are babies. Wait, so it's the same. He said it's the same. He said, yeah, it is the same. People are babies. It's the same. See, so that's what I'm saying. It makes no sense that people are like, wait, they're different games. I'm like, they're the same game as what was remade. Yo, he said chat line. You see, the Sonic man himself, he said, no, they're the same. Don't listen to the, bro. The Sonic man himself said it, bro. Motherfucker does no one remember Sonic Colors D's? Nah. 
I'm no longer taking anything. What? Look, if the Sonic man himself said that they're the same shit, anybody in the chat who says anything otherwise is going through one ear out the other. I'm not hearing shit now. But the OG was better. You said, why do I have to play the DS version? The OG wasn't as buggy. Dude. Yo, hold on, hold on. Games Cage, Games Cage. We, we were actually talking about something very important. Games Cage. Are you a Phantom Thief, sir? No, 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 like, like real talk. Are you a Phantom Thief? I have to ask, man, are you a Phantom Thief? Oh, he's not in here. He probably left. He probably left. <laughs> he's there. He said, don't worry about iGen, bro. I had my I had my guys on the job. He's a Phantom Thief. I told you. This motherfucker's a Phantom Thief. I said that shit. How the hell IGN out the blue have a change of heart on some sorry, but Sonic the Hedgehog was always good. That is weird as fuck. Bro! Yo, also, Fidel, how the hell you get the hookup with Atlas? I'm like the biggest persona stan, and they don't acknowledge my existence. They hate me. Give me the keys so Atlas can hook my ass up too, because it's not fair. I'm the biggest persona stan. I want to be a fan of Thief. They hate me. Every time I'm like, yo, Atlas, so what's popping, bro? Um, bro, I love Persona 5. I, I played the game over... 500 hours into and they're like nah man fuck this guy we ain't gonna give him shit that's cap he said wait he said persona one and two don't exist they don't though one and two don't exist that's why they re-releasing three four and five bro no 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 persona one and two don't exist that's why they're releasing only three four five where's one and two Oh my God, man. Oh my goodness, dude. Yo, they really, yo, if, and look, the second, if Atlas acknowledges one and two and re-releases them. Persona Stan, he says, but he won't buy the two Persona games coming out soon or Persona 5 Royal on PS5. This why you ain't sponsored by Atlas. I purchased Persona freaking 5 Vanilla on the PS4. Then purchased Royal. Now I got a triple dip in Persona to get Persona 5 on the PS5. I don't want a triple dip. And it's $60 to triple dip. You said, did you clap the girl's cheek? What are you talking about? You wouldn't have your fucking Persona 3, 4, and 5 without THE1ST game dipshit. When Atlas remakes one and two, then I'ma play it. Cause ain't no way I'm playing that game in the state that it's in. That game looking chopped as fuck. Have you seen the characters? They look chopped as hell. The gameplay looks mad chopped. Where's the Persona Q2 stream me biggest Persona fan? Wait, as a matter of fact, I could play Persona Q. But don't I have to use the touch screen like a million times? Don't I have to use the touch screen like a million times? The gameplay is eh. It's a 3DS game. Oh. You say you play the OG Mario? No, OG Mario, look, look, look. Here's the difference. OG Mario is so easy to pick up and play because... I don't know, something about Mario games, you could play the oldest Mario game and still enjoy yourself. But the oldest Persona games though, it's like, it's chopped. Bro, let me show you some gameplay of Persona 1. Hold on, Persona 1 gameplay.
Y'all got me fucked up. Y'all got me fucked up. I'm not playing this shit. I'm not playing this shit. Oh. This should look like Zonky Zero. Now I hate it times a hundred. This should look like Zonky Zero Dungeon Crawler. Ew! What the fuck? Where's he walking? Oh, that's my song though. That's the one good thing about this game is the soundtrack. Other than that, everything else is doo-doo. Persona Bro. 1 and 2 are weird there. Persona 1 happened, I'm not gonna spoil, but Persona 2 technically didn't happen, but the characters exist in universe in 3 slash 4 slash 5. Jesus. Jesus. Yo, look, here's my thing. If they were to remake 1 and 2 more up to date into like, not in today's gen graphics, like they were to remake it to make it a bit more playable and a bit more accessible... I would definitely play that shit. I don't know if they're ever going to do that, though, because I feel like Persona, like, let's keep it a stack. Atlas only ever focuses on 3, 4, and 5. They never focus on 1 and 2. I don't know why, but if they were to remake 1 and 2, of course I'd play it. But god damn, you said it's coming? Bro, that's like, that's like almost copium talk next to us, like, praying for Persona 6, because they're still milking Persona 3, 4, and 5 to the bone. Like, 6 is never coming out, as well as, like, 1 and 2 remakes. You said they brought those back from the grave? They will make a Persona 3 remake before 1 and 2? True. Atlas gotta be like Game Freak and milk the OG games like how Game Freak milks Kanto. Atlas. I was telling my friend, what if they made a Persona 3 remake with a new engine that would be used for Persona 6 just like what they did with Catherine and P5? I mean... I mean, A... I mean, I wouldn't hate it. That's another thing I wish Atlas could do, to be honest. If they were to make, like, another Catherine-style game, they don't even have to use Vincent. I mean, don't get me wrong. I would love to see Vincent in more hijinks because I like him as a character. If they were to make another Catherine game, I would love that shit because I actually love the puzzle aspect of the game. I think it's very fun. And I have a good time with the puzzles. Like, I'm never bored when I'm playing Catherine. Like, I could play Catherine for hours. I, I personally love the game. 